Welcome, my name is Andreas Klamsaberort. I'm a Tunisian, French, German journalist, author of 11 books published, writer and broadcast journalist. I'm also the founder and director of the Volunteer Network, which has been founded on October 21st in the year 2015 in the German city of Ludwigshafen am Rhein in Germany and on Facebook pages and on Facebook groups and even on WordPress. IRSC Global stands for International Refugee Support Community. We are trying to provide aid and support through education and information worldwide, beyond borders and without borders, for asylum seekers and for refugees which are trying to find help and aid support in Germany and in Europe. Some days ago I had the chance to talk with refugees from a country of Syria which had to flee because of a Daesh or so-called terrorists and their journey took 21 days to travel from Syria by train, by boat, by ship, by food from Syria to Germany and recently about two months ago we had the chance to arrive in the German city of Ludwigshafen am Rhein and we have been able to find some help with the local authorities and with the German government in the city of Ludwigshafen am Rhein and that you might get some impression What are the reasons why we have left their country, Syria in this case? And what was the reason we had to flee from? The refugee, one of them, will tell you in the English language so that you might get some ideas yourself. I'm very thankful that I do have a chance to talk with a refugee from the country of Syria. What was the reason you have left your country and you had to flee from Syria to Germany? Uh, I, I come from Syria to Germany with uh, walk and train. I come uh, uh, first one, go to Lebanon, from Lebanon go to uh, Turkish, and from Turkish I go to uh, Greek. Uh, and uh, another uh, uh, Macedonia after uh, Serbia after Serbian I uh, go to uh, Hungary uh, and uh, Austria and uh, here in Germany so how many days you have been traveling from Syria uh, to Germany t 21 21 days yeah. by walking by food by train by and train, with a boat ship, all, all of that Yeah. What was the reason you had to flee from Syria? Uh, what was your reason why you have been why you have been forced to flee from your country from Syria? Uh, For which reason you you had to flee from Syria? Uh, have you been affected by terrorism or by war? Because, uh, yeah. Daesh, you know Daesh. Because Dash, uh, terrorists. Oh, uh, terrorists is Dash. You call them Dash. Dash. That's, that's the word in Syrian in Arabic language for terrorists. Yeah. Terrorism. It's Dash. Yeah. yeah. So, so you you have been threatened by terrorists. You have been in danger for your health and for your life. Uh, yeah, because uh, the Dash don't leave me go from uh, my city to the Aleppo or to the Damascus uh, for uh, uh, I take it anything I buy uh, food or uh, uh, something uh, he don't take me go from uh, Al Kamishli yeah. Al Hasaka yeah. from, from Al Hasaka uh, Dash don't leave me go to the Aleppo or uh, 
Damascus. You have to flee alone or with uh, your family? I'm, I'm here alone, but my family in uh, Syria. Your family is still back in the country of Syria. Yeah. Is your family safe in the country of Syria? Uh, yeah, because uh, uh, the PAD, PKK, you know PKK? No. Uh, PKK, uh, the... Uh, oh, but Kur the Kurdish forces. Yeah, yeah. yeah uh, the PKK and PAD saved the Kurdish men mm -hmm. in uh, al Qamishli. So we're trying to protect the local people in Syria? And your family, is this right? We're trying to protect you or to save your life, uh, but save, uh, to save the life of your family? Um, uh, he he, he protect, uh, the Payadeh protect my family. He yeah. protect your family? Yeah, because he's, uh, he have war with the Daesh and yeah. uh, he killed the Daesh uh, and he saved the people in the uh, al -Kamshli. So in how many, Syria. how long do you live in Germany? Since, how many weeks do you live in Germany? Uh, um, before two uh, months. Since two months you live in Germany? Yeah. How do you think about Germany? Do you like the country? Do you like the people? Yeah, it's, uh, it's good. Uh, the people is, uh, it's, uh, relation uh, is good, uh, the country is good, uh, uh, it's good for uh, for good life. What is your profession? What do you do usually in the country of Syria to, to earn and to care, take care for your family? What is your job? What do you do for work? What do you do for life? Oh, uh, I want uh, uh, help my family, and I want uh, the world know is Daesh is uh, terrorist, yeah. uh, and uh, I want uh, I want uh, the world help Syrian uh, for uh, peace. Uh, we don't uh, want the war. We don't want kill the people. Uh, Do you, see, do, do you see any chance for peace in the near future? Uh, I think no, <laughs> because uh, nobody wants that. No. Nobody wants peace in Syria? Syrian want that, yeah. but uh, another uh, country is don't like that, because I don't know why. So if, if if another country won't uh, make peace in Syria, yeah. I think uh, uh, he can't do it. Yeah. So, do you believe Russian and American forces could help could help to to bring peace to Syria? Um, if he won't, maybe he can make peace. But, in Syria. but it might be not the only one solution, and <coughs> might be probably not the best solution, the military intervention of the Russian forces and of the American forces. Wouldn't it be great or wouldn't it be helpful to have talks for peace in Syria with all parties involved, with all groups of people? Uh, all people uh, know uh, if, if uh, American and uh, Russian want to make peace in Syria, he can make peace in Syria. Uh, the Daesh is uh, not uh, very uh, big or, and uh, it's uh, not, don't have uh, many uh, person. He just uh, uh, small group. If uh, American and uh, Russian want make peace in Syria and he can't do it that. It's not uh, difficult. But it will it be a process of many months or even years to reach the goal, to reach the aim to obtain peace in Syria? I don't understand. How long it will probably take to, to obtain peace in Syria?
What do you believe? Will it be possible probably next year or if, in three if, years? If everybody wants that, uh, maybe one year can uh, make peace in Syria. Because Daesh is not uh, very uh, big. Uh, the Kurdish man is a uh, uh, little person. Yeah. Uh, PYD is uh, it's not big uh, a group, but he can uh, kill uh, more from Daesh. Mm. In case if peace will come back to Syria, to your country where your father and your mother has been born, would you travel back to Syria? Mm, um, sure. I'm sure I, I want to uh, see my family and I want to uh, 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 be Syrian, is be uh, peace. As long as there's no peace in Syria, do you expect or do you have the hope that your family will be able to travel safe from Syria to Germany? Uh, if if uh, I can, in, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. I won't, but uh, I don't know if I, I can't or not. Mm -hmm. I can't. Uh, how much is it? How much do you have to pay for a journey from Syria to Germany? How expensive is it? Uh, for for, for uh, one person, I, yeah, for one person? Uh, I paid uh, 3,000 euros. 3,000 euros. Yeah. And uh, many people, they are not able to pay oh, the 3,000 so euros. Some people uh, paid uh, maybe 10,000 euros. Wow. Yeah. I'm, I'm from uh, Kamishli. Uh, it's not difficult. But uh, f somebody from Aleppo or uh, from Arraka, uh, uh, Dash is there. Yeah. Uh, he, he need more more money for uh, come to uh, Germany, maybe seven, eight, nine, ten mm. uh, thousand euros. Do you have any knowledge about the Syrian airports? Are we still in duty, or are the Syrian airlines not able anymore to transport people? Uh, we don't have uh, anything uh, airline or. Uh, from Syria to any country. There's no airline from Syria to any other country? Yeah, maybe just to Lebanon. Only to Lebanon, but not yeah. to Europe? No. Uh, to Europe, I, um, no, nobody can uh, 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 c come to Europe with yeah. airline because uh, he need the... Uh, visa, I guess? Visa, visa, yeah. yeah. Are you not able, uh, for example, if you go online on the World Wide Web, for example, the American Embassy, they offer sometimes to register for a visa online on their website. Is this possible for the people of Syria? And if you want to register in Germany, do you have a chance to access the Internet and to register online for visa? Oh, no. It's chance is... Uh, There's no access? Yeah. To it's which is the online just because uh, um, somebody need uh, uh, register before one or yeah. two year yeah nobody uh, all of, all people don't uh, don't uh, can uh, wait for uh, visa because uh, the war is not stopped what happened when you have entered the country of Germany? How people have been treating you and how, uh, trying to help you? What happened when you arrived in Germany? Had you some people which supported you and gave you food, shelter, yeah. medical yeah. care? Yeah, everybody in uh, Germany is uh, help uh, uh, Syrian people uh, food and. Uh, uh, house and uh, a medical uh, uh, <coughs> um, so, so you have a room where to stay you're getting medical care and food uh, and uh, some help by local authorities in Germany.
تقول؟ جوفرمنت. ذا جوفرمنت ان جيرماني هيلب هيلب سيريان بيبل. That's great. For uh, all things, uh, uh, clothes, yeah, uh, yeah. food, uh, uh, accommodation. This is yeah. very good. So, so you have accommodation, a room where to stay, and you're getting food. Do does the German government offers courses for the German language? Yeah, I have uh, a course uh, next uh, month. Yeah. Yeah. He give uh, the German uh, government give the, the course for free uh, uh, for uh, Syrian people. You? How many languages are you able to speak? You speak Arabic. I speak Arabic and uh, Kurdish, little English. Wow. And uh, now little. Deutschland. Yeah, Deutsch. but but your knowledge of the English language is excellent, and uh, I guess Arabic is your native language, your mother tongue, <coughs> I guess. Um, so you speak quite a lot of languages, and you will learn German also. Yeah. What do you? What are your wishes and dreams about what to work in Germany? What do you desire to do yeah, for uh, for living? I I study uh, accounting. Yeah. And. Uh, uh, computer uh, information and uh, service uh, I want to uh, work here uh, uh, by mobile and uh, computer service but or or a, co a counter I yeah. don't know yeah. it sounds good and I wish you only the best and for your family too but you will have a good time in Germany and but you will be able to travel safe from Syria to Germany thank you Thank you so much. Would you Thank be you so much for this interview? Thank you so much for this we interview. We will air it on the World Wide Web. Do but you people agree? Probably might understand but your people probably might understand but your situation, but it will situation, be broadcasted on the internet, on the internet to explain people some stories, people people of, some stories of the people of Syria and their quite, difficult, journey from, quite from difficult journey from from Syria to yeah. Germany and the their circumstances yeah the circumstances which you have, been, which you have been going through because yeah, of war and terrorism thank you and uh, we, we want uh, everybody to know uh, Daesh is um, it's very bad uh, people and uh, is uh, Everybody know what, <laughs> yeah. what, yeah. what yeah. means that story is. Yeah. Uh, and we want uh, everybody help uh, Syrian uh, people uh, for make peace. Uh, thank you. I give thanks to you. I give thanks to you and I wish you only the best and for your family too. Thank you. IRSC Global, International Refugee Support Community, as a volunteer community, we are trying to help as volunteers, refugees which are seeking asylum, shelter and aid, support in Germany and in Europe through information and education. This was a story of one asylum seeker of one refugee from the country of Syria which had to flee because of war and because of the threats caused by terrorists. All refugees, all people which try to find room, shelter and support in Germany, they might have a different story, but in many cases it's the story, the sad story, that they had to flee because of war, because of violence and because of threats through terrorists. And I guess it is our responsibility and it is very important to help people which are in need. Resi asylum seekers, refugees, which try to find shelter, relief and aid in Germany and in Europe. You will find plenty of information and a lot of information on IRSC Global dot WordPress dot com. More information about 
IRSC Global you will find on our blog, on our website, International Refugee Support Community Global, ircglobal.wordpress.com. Or give me a call, which is in Germany, 0049621586780554. If you want to give me a phone call, feel free to call me at any time in the country of Germany. Our phone number of IRSC Global International Refugee Support Community is 0049621586780554. Thanks for joining this broadcast from IRSC Global. My name is Andreas Klamsabart. I'm a Tunisian, French, German journalist, writer, broadcast journalist and author of 11 books published and I'm the founder and director of IRSC Global.